Hey guys, Josh coming to you live with another Barefoot Shoe Review. And today, I have to be honest with you, you know, I do the unboxings and stuff on these videos. I am redoing this video. I, I opened these things already and I did my little review and I was about to go do my fashion show. And the second I put them on my feet, I said, oh my God, I got to redo this video because I was not nearly as enthusiastic as I should have been about these shoes. Because the second I put them on my feet, I was sold like you wouldn't believe. These are probably, uh, I mean, in... They're semi-dressed, they could be fully dressed, they're slip-ons, uh, but they are definitely my favorite in that category and they are butta. So you're gonna wanna watch this review if you have any interest in a in a office casual, semi-dress, dress-up, slip-on shoe made of leather. Oh my God, these are sick. And okay, so they're from Aintap Leather. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly. It's A-I-N-T-A-P, all one word, Aintap Leather. It's a company in Turkey and all my contact with the owner has been like, you know, stellar, fantastic. He's very communicative, very flexible, like wanting to work with me and serve with me. I mean, these things got in the mail here. Here's the bag they came in. It's a little branded uh, like linen bag from Turkey, handmade. Um, just every little bit of contact with this company. It's just, it's the little things, guys, that, that make, look at the bag. I mean. That's, that's enough reason. And, you know, I order shoes from Germany, different places in Europe. They take two, three, sometimes four weeks to get here. These things came from Turkey, every bit as far, and they got here in less than a week. I don't, I don't know what he did to make that happen, if he did anything out of the ordinary, or if that's just their normal shipping. But uh, these are handmade uh, leather shoes. Uh, and there's different styles, okay? Some of you might see the stitching and not like that. I actually chose that because I think it's such a cool look. Um, and you see this little bit of leather. That's another little surprise. Check this out. They send you a little, like a keychain with a miniature handmade slip-on shoe on there. What company does that? What company have you ever dealt with? <laughs> shoe company that sent you a miniature of their shoes as like a little keychain or a keepsake. I mean, uh, just from start to finish. I, I, I mean, these things are mind blowing. So let me get through the review here. I will tell you on their website, you know, I don't, I'm not in love with their website for, you know, you have to scroll through pages and pages and pages of shoes, which is great. They have lots of selection. They have colors, they have men's, they have women's, they have lace-ups, they have slip-ons, they have athletic kind of sporty styles. Uh, he also has an Etsy page where they have some other styles on there. Uh, they have slippers, they have, you know, I went through 17 pages on their website just looking at every shoe because he, he you know he graciously gifted these to me to review i don't know maybe because they're in turkey and they could use some some more video reviews but he he said which pair do you want and i so i he, i did my i did my research <laughs> i looked through there man they have dark blue they have black they have red yellow orange green almost any color purple any color you can think of they have like i said slip-ons lace-ons men's women's unisex ones um like pretty much you name it. If, if you have any interest in a leather, uh, handmade shoes from Turkey, do. J at least do yourself a favor. Scroll through the website. I'm going to do a little. <laughs> my little thumbnail image for the video. But oh my gosh. I'm, can you see the smile? It's hard to wipe it off my face because I just had these on my feet a minute ago. And um, dude, let me get into it. All right. So. Oh, for those of you that aren't following me on Instagram, please follow me on Instagram at Barefoot Shoe Josh. Why? There's more detailed reviews there. Okay, these videos are nice and everything. You know, I talk and I can talk, talk through it and be a little silly or whatever. But on Instagram, I have 10 different categories that I rate each shoe on, on a scale of one to 10, total score possible of 100. So that's a detailed review. There's additional information in there, cool pictures, blah, 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 whatever. Follow me on Instagram at Barefoot Shoe Josh. Hit like, hit subscribe here, hit the notifications bell. I, I do sale notifications, whatever, whatever, whatever. If you like Barefoot Shoes, you're gonna like to follow this channel anyways. So get her done. All right, there you go. So zero drop from heel to toe. Um, no arch supports on the inside and anatomic foot shape, look at the shape, it's shaped like a human foot. It's not shaped like a pointy whatever wedge that you're supposed to jam your toes into for the rest of your life. Um, and flexible. So these are interesting. So the flexibility is maybe not like a two millimeter, you know, rubber Vibram sole or something, but look at, I mean, that's plenty. And you can even do the little taco test on these guys, look at that. And so you're like, what are these soles made out of? I'm going to show you. Look how smooth they are. And look at the shape. 
Dude, uh, they are... So the uppers are made of Nubuck leather. It's gorgeous. I chose navy blue because I wear blue jeans a lot. And these are like the semi... They call these sport style with the, with the visible thread. They have like a more dress style that doesn't have the thread. All you see is the edge of the sole. But I like the, how that looks. I just thought it was the extra style points. Look at that. It's so cool looking. Um, but I chose the navy blue. Just I don't know if you can tell in the video. It looks like it might be black on the video. But they're dark navy blue. They have every color you can imagine as I mentioned. A little bit of elastic here. Just for fitting purposes I guess. Just to get it just right. I was a little concerned about what size to get. I looked at their sizing chart. And I, it looked like it could fit probably two different sizes. I normally wear 45s or 44s. I don't own a single pair of shoes that's 43, but on their chart, it looked like mm, maybe I might want to do a 43, but I had already asked him for a 44. He had already sent it. So I'm like, cool, I'll try the 44s. No problem. Because uh, with a slip-on shoe, I was a little concerned. What if they come out too big? They might slip off. Dude, they fit perfect, the 44. So like I said, I normally wear 44 or 45s. They fit perfect. Little room to spare in the toes, just like I like it. Um, they're extra wide. I have extra wide feet. Just check out the sizing chart when you go on their website. I'll put all the links down below, including their Etsy, their regular website, whatever, whatever I have. I don't think I'm going to even have an affiliate uh, link for these guys, um, but I don't care. I want to push these shoes because they are sick. Uh, so new book leather, uh, real leather on the inside too. I don't know. It's not, I forget the term for the leather on the inside, but it's just leather. But here's the, the kicker. The soles are made of water buffalo leather. Have you ever heard of water buffalo leather? I certainly haven't. But that's what these are made of. Look at them. It's like a thick piece of leather. That's it. Um, dude, I, I'm blown away because when I put them on my feet, okay, on the inside, you're standing on that same piece of water bu buffalo leather. You know, leather, it's going to take on the form of your foot over time. And these things I already feel beautiful when you put them on your feet. And uh, so once your foot really, though, makes a dent into the leather over time, I, I just can't imagine. These things are so pretty. And so, like I said, if you are into uh, handmade leather shoes that are extra wide, barefoot status, um, they have some, I think they might have some on there that are non-barefoot. So make sure you choose one that says barefoot. Mine said barefoot navy blue leather, handmade men sport Yemeni slip-on shoes. So I don't know if that's uh, because these folks, while they're shipping them from Turkey, if they're Yemeni from Yemen, uh, or if it's just a Yemeni style of shoe that they liked to make or what, but man, they're pretty. <laughs> and okay, so leather lining, that's all I got to say. I don't, I don't have any other stuff. I'm going to do a quick little fashion show, maybe a little walk test, maybe not because I, I put them on my feet and the instant I slid them on my feet, I said, oh my God, I got to redo the video because I am blown away by, by these shoes. And I, I don't think I came across as blown away on my video. And I want to because, oh my God, they are nice. So check it out if you want to see them on my feet. Hang around. Otherwise, hit like, hit subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Barefoot Shoe Josh. Uh, see you in a minute. Check these out. Man, I mean. I mean, you feel like you're floating on a cloud. These, I, I have some comfortable shoes, okay? These maybe take the cake over my slippers over anything i like i love these things I, yeah granted i've been wearing them less than five minutes but i mean dude I, I i'm trying not to exaggerate but these things are blowing me away with the style the comfort just the quality you look at them and the quality is like oh my god um so yeah these are sick. <laughs> Enough said. Follow the links. Get yourself a pair. I mean, if you like comfortable shoes like me, like I'll, I'll take comfort over beauty. Uh, when it comes to shoes, but if you can get comfort and beauty, that's a, a, a good combination. And these comfort, beauty, quality, uh, gosh, I forgot to tell you the price. I want to say they're like 85, 95 bucks, somewhere in that range. I should have uh, been better prepared for that. Sorry.
but um, well worth it, man. If they were twice that price, they would be worth it. These things, uh, wow, <laughs> blown away. Um, so anyway, let me know your thoughts if you get to try them out. They're amazing. So um, talk to you guys soon. Hit like, hit subscribe, follow me on Instagram. Talk to you later.